Tom Brady hasn't signed with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers yet. <laughs> that is a Boston Connor evil laugh from the phones because he's holding on hope, I'd assume, that maybe this means Tom Brady's going to come back to the Patriots. I'm not 100% sure if that's the case. The initial report from Mike Florio on Pro Football Talk is what's holding this whole thing up is his inability to be able to travel to get the physical from the Tampa Bay Buccaneers doctors because he is older. He's 42. I don't think he's ever really had... Uh, an injury here in the last year. I don't think any of that would be the case. But I assume at the age of 42, when you're about to put $60 million into somebody, if you're the owner, you would like to see if that guy's going to be able to perform at a level. Physicals are something that always happen in the NFL. And with this inability to travel, it does put a strain on things. And then Jeff Darlington answered that with a tweet of his own, basically saying like, nope, Everything's moving along smooth as possible. There's no concern over finding a doctor uh, to perform Tom Brady's physical. He's able to make that happen today in New York. It would be ideal if it was the Tampa Bay Buccaneers team doctors, but these are unprecedented times, and everyone is on the same page here. So Jeff Darlington is in a great position. Jeff Darlington gets to scan the internet, take a picture of something, send it to Tom Brady, and say, excuse me. Is this accurate? And then he gets an immediate response. It goes, nope, we're actually getting tested in New York. We're thinking about doing it in Tampa. We've all uh, kind of re rethought the whole thing. I'm just going to do it where I'm at, and then they'll send it down there. These are trusted doctors that the Buccaneers people like. And Darlington's like, okay, you got it. <laughs> hey, Mr. Rappaport. Hey, Florio. Hey, everybody. Uh, there's actually no concern from Tom Brady. Jo Darlington said that he was leaving New England like two weeks ago on ESPN on GetUp. Two he was sitting on the edge, and he said like, hey, it is becoming very clear, I think, to the people that are around Tom Brady. He, he could have been referring to himself, by the way, mm -hmm. that he is leaving New England and this is not happening. And at the time on the set, I think he kind of got mocked. I think people were like, at this point, he can't leave. He's going to end up going back, blah, 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 blah. And throughout this entire time, Jeff Darlington in his bedroom at his house on, on uh, ESPN with the white background, he's been 100% right. So Tom Brady. He's getting a physical from New York doctors or they're waiting until this whole thing passes. And then I assume they'll just sign him to be a Tampa Bay Buccaneer. The press conference also wouldn't be that great of a look right now, a celebration, I think, in the time that we're at. I don't know if that's a, a thing that a lot of people would want to see. And I don't know if that's something that Tom Brady or the Tampa Bay Buccaneers are thinking about. But it is probably the right move, given the circumstances. Well, I believe that teams are, still aren't even allowed to announce free agent moves yet like the vikings last yesterday had a tweet we are not allowed to announce free agent moves yet but rumors are we signed this person oh so they're like dancing around correct it? <laughs> i love that like they got a memo league-wide probably that said hey no announcement of any signings we just don't think now is the right time to celebrate something and blah 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 right so then the vikings see all these insiders leaking information about their team and they're like well we have to say something all right, well, we're not allowed to do this, but from what everybody else has been saying, uh, we could say that uh, we agree with what they're saying. <laughs> that's an interesting thing. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly thing. what happened. That's exactly what happened, right? Like, that's like Roger Goodell basically <laughs> saying to them, will you please not announce it? If it gets out, it gets out. And the Vikings are just like, yeah, no worries. Per reports, uh, we have agreed to terms <laughs> with Michael Pierce. I like that the Vikings are trolling the entire memo in the process. That's good for the Vikings. They just extended Kirk Cousins as well. Mm -hmm. Stephon Diggs gets shipped over to Buffalo Bills. Will Josh Allen be able to throw him a football? Nobody knows. But this NFL free agency has been a godsend during this time we're in right now.